Yeah. <laughs> you feel me? Mm. Y'all saw the video or not? Yeah. I saw the snippet. You gotta tune that's in. You gotta tune in. I feel like social media is low-key, like... It's filtered so much. It, it, it's everyone. killing everyone's <laughs> access to, like, actually like click alone, something and so watch it. Yeah. 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 Like, no, 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 no. Yeah. I know that, right? But for example, right? When, when somebody posts their music video on their Instagram and they're like, out now. Nine times out of ten, somebody's gonna watch that 60 second clip, comment, and act like they watched it. Nah, you know what I mean? It's like it's, 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 it's slowly starting to die out. Like actually clicking on the link, unless you're just like a true hard fan that's on the YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Like that's why I post my vlogs on the thing. Like the full vlog, I'm posting it right there. Because if you watch that shit, you watch that shit right there. Right there. Right there. You don't even gotta do all that extra. Go to the two. No. And that's, I have people who sat there and watched that whole 17 minute shit. I watch it right there on the gram. Fuck it, yeah. I've, I'm not gonna hold you. The first time I seen the vlog, I was like, alright, this shit about to be hilarious. I know this nigga be living some type of movie, bro. Wait till the next episode, bro. Wait till the next episode. The episode is next episode about to be stupid. Right now, we just like, we just put it out. It's awesome. I can't do that. No people know what's going on. But like, I also want to get away from, I, like, I, I wish I just never did that celebrity shit again. Like, that shit was just like, that's not me. Realistically, I don't like being around like celebrities, like sticking cameras in their face. Like, I think that shit's a black. I'd always shoot him like a normal person. <laughs> yeah. Unless, yeah. unless I shoot yeah. Rihanna. That's a different story, you know what I mean? Grande? Both of them. Oh, Rihanna. 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 I think she's Rihanna. 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 I'll take both of them. Oh, 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 Chloe. <sighs> Bailey? Oh, that's baby. Girl. That's his girlfriend. <laughs> that's his girlfriend. Listen, y'all niggas better be careful talking about my girlfriend. That's his girlfriend. Funny, bro, because I really. I really have a special, me and her have a special connection going on, you know what I'm trying to say? I look, I look forward to her posts on a daily basis. She knows you? Nah, that's his, that's his queen, but she don't know you. I, I know she's seen she the comments, because I'm too there. Like, uh-huh. Like, I'm too there. Like, they uh-huh. read those comments, too. Don't think they don't read those comments. They read those comments. Oh, yeah. Bro. And the, she knows she's seen too. She's seen them. What? When are you going? You going to post that on your story? She's going to be posting back with a heart. Thanks. And look, she better not do that. <laughs> <laughs> she better not do that Cause I'm hulking it down uh, Anyway, what's going on man? It's your boy Kimo the 8 guy man It's the Spot Podcast X the Parlay Podcast I'm with the fucking guys sir, And you know what the fuck about Man, guys, introduce yourselves Speed Phil Kames Y'all know what it is PNB Rock <laughs> <laughs> You think he look like PNB Rock more as he got older or not? Yeah, yeah. Bro. I seen him with the whole bro. beard, it's full, the beard. It's full the beard, beard like bro. full beard, not cut. Bro. People used to say, "Look at Oscar from Shark Tale." <laughs> it's giving more Oscar than um um than P and B. Yeah, for sure. Cause P and B, like he type white skin. You know, Oscar, he got you know the same shape hat. But you know, we gonna get into that. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, uh, what's going on, podcast? Yeah. Um, this is the Parlay Podcast X Spot Podcast. This is the first. Podcast collab in the town. First of all, you know I mean? if I'm not mistaken, we, if we from the town. We in the town, and we got this done in the town. I reached out to so many other podcasts to get up here. For some reason, nobody wanted to get up here. Everybody had an ego. Because <laughs> now you asked out. Um, we got the guys up here, so I want to appreciate you guys for coming up here. First of all, these are the guys from high school too. You guys are seeing some regular shit. We just up here to parlay at the spot, right? Yes, sir. Exactly. The parlay with three E's. Three E's, three right. E's. So, guys, talk about, talk about a little bit about the parlay, what you guys got going on. You guys, If you guys that don't know, the parlay podcast is the, one of the newest podcasts to hit the town. My guys is up there giving y'all comedy and just straight everything you need to fucking see. Y'all need to go tune in. Make sure y'all tune in because these niggas are in, stupid. In. Uh, so, yeah, y'all go ahead, man. Take it away. You want me to break it down? Yeah. No, you can break it down, bro. Damn, all right. So, not gonna hold you. I had this podcast idea for a while. You know, I hit the guys up about it. I was like, yo, let's drop a podcast. I just don't want to have people feel like I'm buying it off of everybody else in the town or Kingo, because Kingo had just came out with his. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. Forget about it. How, a how, year how, later. Now, how, 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 we, was, we was recording before that. We really? was doing YouTube videos. Yeah, I was. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, I forgot yeah, I was. about that. I we, saw those. We, that's we when we had the little Twitter group chat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. We even had our little, you yeah. know. Shout YouTube. out Twitter. What's going on, Twitter? You know Twitter <laughs> fucking with us. <laughs> 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 and then we was like, he was like, yo, we should just do the podcast. We 
talk mm-hmm. about shit every all day. time. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, yeah, we're, we're, regular we're, life. We're, we'll be bullshitting. Like, I talk about, I want to talk about this, talk about that, and like, we just about one day we just talk about like. Why don't we get out of here? What we're talking about, exactly. like, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We 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 we, we speaking facts, and then we also be speaking some bullshit. This is oh, generation yeah. we in. Nah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You just gotta. This is what you gotta do, man. If you ain't if you ain't podcasting with the boys at home, I don't know what to tell you. Realistically, this people are, local people local was getting real money today. Yeah, but go ahead and carry on. So I was like, yo, I dropped the tweet on Twitter. Everybody showed me mad love on it. You know, I jumped on the ASAP. Everybody showed me mad love. Get me on there first. I didn't even have the podcast name, the podcast idea where I was going right. to record at. None of that. King was like, yeah, I need to be on there first. Type shit, bro. Yo, matter of fact, you, you, want, you want to tell me how, you want to tell me how, how, how we got the part of the name? Yes. Would love to hear that. Honestly, you know they got the pure white up here. They not playing hookah. Yo, they got the spot looking lit. We got to go with the Paul. Yeah. Like, <laughs> she. <laughs> she. <laughs> Honestly, yeah. like, I was just cool, and I was like, you know what, the parlay, because if you really know what parlay means, it means like you sitting and talking, you're just talking about anything. Mm-hmm. So I was like, yo, that's exactly us. We literally just talk about anything yeah, facts. from anywhere. And I was like, oh, the parlay club at first, but then I had changed it, and I asked him if it was like you can still be a club. With it. Yeah, we still have you can club. still have the club, you know? No, yeah. Not but I was like, you know, it sounds kind of tacky, and the Instagram name would be too long. So I just cut off the club. But if you look on our logo, you'll see TPC on the mic. Mm. And now you'll know what the TP, TPC stands for. Because everybody would always ask me what it meant. Yeah, yeah. So now you understand where it is, where it came from. Look, look it's, all, it's, it's whatever it is. You got the club. You got the podcast. Yeah. You got the parlay, uh, 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 uh. Whatever, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> you can just fucking run with this shit. Whatever yeah. you're doing, the parlay it is. The parlay party, the, the parlay and fucking everything. Everything. You everything. know, it's three E's. The everything. parlay everything. 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 You feel me? Nah, so yeah, that's dope. And um, we going to definitely parlay up here at the spot. So uh, I know that's that's what they waiting for. So with that being said, let's get into the quote of the day of the spot podcast. So the quote of the day on the Spot Podcast, ex Parlay Podcast Club, everything, whatever the fuck <laughs> you want to call it, <laughs> right? This guy. We're gonna jump off like this. If you think a man is supposed to do everything for you because you're pretty, <clears throat> you're a fucking bum. Facts. Facts. Okay. I'm not hearing it. Yeah. <laughs> not you are a bum. Like all, all the tweets of affirmations, you can you can repost all those memes, all those quotes. No matter what you say, when you get off that fucking phone, make sure you get a job. There's job applications all over the fucking place. I think Shoprite's hiring anything. They might even hire you if you're dead. That's scary. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. I'm not having that. It's like and like it's getting too comfortable and normalized, and I'm we, we can't have that. No, nah, I'm nah, not with that. How y'all feel about that? Nah, I don't. I can't fuck with a bum. <laughs> I can't fuck with a bum. You gotta have some type of passion. The fuck is yo? What is you doing at home, uh, bullshitting or, or, or out of your friends? When, when in front I, of your ring light. Like, <laughs> you not even get paid for the ring light. Do you not even get paid for this Instagram video shit. Like, come on. So what is? All right, so boom. Granted, what if they are getting the bag off just sitting at the crib? I mean, that's dope. I'm right. I ain't got a problem. I ain't got a problem with that. Yeah, but it's like, you as long as you bring a song, that's like, yeah, the table. exactly. Other than head and pussy, y'all really got y'all really don't got much to offer because a lot of y'all just expect a man to take care of you for your whole life. And, and that would. No. Men, men get bored. I'm not your father, basically. But, That's what I'm trying to tell you. I'm not your father. Nah, nah, nah. Speaking about that, bro, some, some, some bozo shawty, she, she was like, oh, she, she was like, how, oh, how, how, how like, um, some, 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 some guy asked her, what, what the woman brings to the tables, uh, what, what the woman brings to the table, she, uh, yeah. and she, and she, she, she talked to the rose saying, what, the, what do you guys bring to the, what, what do you guys bring to the table, uh, you, 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 and, 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 how, and how, and how, the, how, you guys are wasting her time, because uh, um, um, as guys get older, they get more money, and, and, and as women get younger, um, 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 older, them, 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 they start, like, um, their, their, their prettiness goes, uh, goes, away, goes away. out the window, all that. So, I feel like if that's what you worried about, growing up as a woman, like, you feel like a 
man's supposed to take... Are you saying like a man's supposed to... What the girl said, like a man's supposed to take care of her because as she gets older, she like loses value? Yeah, yeah basically. Yeah. I mean, if you really think about it, right, you only really lost value if you grow and like... I mean, in like... I'm not trying to say, you know, I'm not trying to say how somebody's life is supposed to go, but like if you grow up and like you end up not having a family just because like you're just a very unwantable person and you're just like very miserable nobody can be attracted to you or maybe you don't love yourself and you ruined every relationship you could have possibly been in I right. then you might be like of no value down the road you know what I'm trying to say but like yeah. Yeah. if if you're just a regular woman you got a family you love like you shouldn't be your value shouldn't be about like how you look you know what I'm trying to say? It should be about what you bring to the table to your family. Like, exactly. what do you what, what do you provide? You know what I'm trying to say? What, what are you good for? You know what I'm saying? If you just breathe, <laughs> you just breathe air every day. <laughs> I mean, like, and you don't bring nothing to the table for an old body, then I don't know. But if that was your goal in life, then you shouldn't look at that as like, you shouldn't look at that as like, oh, I lost value. Because some women don't want kids. Some some women don't want family. This is how they that's how they chose for it to be. Yeah. So I guess it's all about how you see your life playing out compared to how it actually played out, you know? But yeah. what about that girl? Y'all saw that video of Shorty? She said, I had a guy get me a Benz before and put me in a loft space and, you know, set my whole life up differently than what it was normally. And I feel like if you brought me to like this level and then we didn't work out, but we're still friends, you know, we don't, we didn't have beef and no one cheated. It was just didn't work out. Um, but I still, ex I, I wasn't going to move from my space because it didn't work out. I wasn't going to give him back my car because I'm not going to downgrade my lifestyle because me and you are no longer together. And I just feel like if you put me in this space and that was under your budget then, what's the difference now? You know what I mean? you were my girlfriend. I was fucking you. Yeah, but I just... I was fucking I you. Just feel, yeah, but I personally feel like, no, I'm not yeah, moving. But see, <laughs> but see, what he did was this, though. He gave you the upgrade, but part of that upgrade is because you're with me. Yes. You understand? So, so let me just go, though. So we didn't work out, me and you dating. You feel me? So I'm supposed to keep paying your loft and keep paying your bins. Now, I get it. You're a true boss if you do that, and that's the the vibe we're getting, but Jazz, No, it's just I'm not moving, and you, you're going to have to deal with it. If you want to stay way, upgraded, stay with, stay with me. If not, go see what's out oh, there. Oh, so then that. So then if that's the case, so yeah. you want me to stay with you for these items and use you, basically. Not for them. If you want to live like this, it comes with being with me. Okay. So, so then so then you would prefer a woman to just stay with you for her items and her lifestyle. My lifestyle is now contingent. My current new lifestyle that you upgraded me to is now contingent on me being in a relationship with you, and that's the only way I can have it in this moment. Then what then stops should, me then you from should just get married, staying then, with Jazz, you for that? Then Jazz, you want him to keep your lifestyle up, keep paying your bills, keep you on that same upgraded level. No, you were dating a man that had money, so dating him came with a lifestyle. But if we not working and our love is dead, I don't owe you to keep paying your, your car note and He's your mortgage. Entitled. I'm not entitled to. Now, if I'm that rich, then okay. But entitled, realistically, though. that isn't really my job. You should find you an, a man like me and upgrade to him and, and keep your but lifestyle. But that takes, that takes time. So I just feel like if someone had me on a certain pedestal, you're not just because I we no longer working you're not just gonna rip the pedestal from me like or i'm gonna feel a type of way and just as petty and ruin them things i'm gonna ruin so, the car i'm gonna trash the house sponsor gonna, you sponsor you make, until you move on not until i move on but give me you so know you until I more time so how do you guys feel about breaking up with your, your significant other and her feeling like you're still supposed to pay for everything that you were paying for <laughs> while you were dating her Nah, that's crazy. If I leveled you up, I'm not gonna continue to level you, you up to go be with another nigga. That's not that's right. not my job. Yeah, I ain't even worried about the other nigga. Fuck him. If I ain't I'm, fucking with you no yeah. more, and I and I had you on a new bands, mm -hmm. or I, I I'm, that's just going back. First of all, like if, if I didn't pay that, it's, it's going that's back. My that shit is getting repo. <laughs> yeah, Quavo. Quavo did what he was supposed <laughs> to. Do. I'm calling Ben Stone straight up. Right. Tap in. <laughs> right. Uh, I'm, I'm taking that car. I'm taking whatever I purchased for you, like bags, shoes. Keep that. Okay. Handle your business. But if there is a bill being paid, <laughs> or if you're living in my house, you're out of here. You're moving the hell out. You're like you're gonna come out, and your bags are gonna be outside. First of all, I'm not even gonna like. I'm giving you a day to pack up. Right, I got a yeah. question. I got a question. So we asked it on the on the on the podcast. If you find her cheating, how long would you give her to pack her shit up? 
He said an hour. I oh, said she I got. Yeah, I, I mean maybe an hour. It depends on how much shit she got. Mm-hmm. You know, like I, I don't like I don't want to have to take it to the point where I gotta start taking stuff too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you feel me? Like I don't want to have to like you know she got mad shit. I'm gonna give her an hour. Cause if you in my house, you realistically only got shit like in the dresser, in yeah. the closet. Uh, maybe maybe you gotta get like uh, I don't know maybe take a dresser I don't Couple know things, yeah. hurry up and get the U-Haul truck something like yeah but make it snappy That's I don't want to wake up and see you here um, moral of the story if as if you were cheating and you're living in my situation or whatever the case may be like yeah right nah not really jacking that at all what if you catch her what what, what if you catch her in the act Honestly, bro, I I, I, like everybody asks. Everybody gets asked that question all the time. They say, "You know what? I'm not gonna care. He he can have her." I hope I never catch my bitch in the nah. ass, fucking somebody, bro. I'm going to jail. But, but, but what if it's a girl? Hot. I'm going to jail. What if, if it's, it's a, a girl? girl? Like she with another shorty. If I walk in on my shorty with another shorty, yeah. yeah. What are y'all doing? What the fuck you mean, yeah? <laughs> what are y'all doing? We know what he doing. <laughs> 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 what are you doing? Man's gonna, man's she gonna, still got to go, but man's gonna pull up and can, like, I, can, can I, I join go? first? <laughs> right, what are you doing? Get the fuck up out of here. <laughs> Both of them? Bro, yeah. Yo, yo. What are you doing? It's a dub off rip. I'm walking out, bro. Nah, I'm going to give you that hour. She a dub, bro. And then that's it. What are you doing? It's a dub? Bro, bro, bro I'm, ca- I'm calling 911 and be like, yo, I got two. You snitching? I got two. Oh! I got two. You can snitch on your shorty for cheating. What? I got two. I'm no woman in my crib. You going to get arrested by the conversation. You got it. I'm fucking his wife. Right. You feel me? Listen, <laughs> if I walked in on my girl, fucking another girl, I'm going to go off her reaction. I'm going like, what's going on here? If I'm not invited immediately, <laughs> imme- you're cheating. You still if I am not invited I mean, you still, immediately, still you are cheating. cheating. Right. Still I cheating. cannot rock with you. You're still cheating if she invites you or not. Look, if she's still cheating, but it's with another girl... Me just being a player, I'm not gonna be. I'm not gonna lose my cards. Fuck that. You feel me? If I'm invited to the party, okay. we could have this party. Would you stay? I'm at? never gonna look at her the same. You feel me? Mm-hmm. I, I probably wouldn't stay with her. Like I, I don't think I'm gonna stay with her. Mm-hmm. But like I'm gonna, I'm gonna ride that situation out as long as I could. You did me wrong, so I'm gonna ride this situation out as long as I can until I find the next one. Play my cards right. Get the fuck out of there. Real player shit. You ain't gonna play me. Fuck you, bitch. You bugging. <laughs> bugging. She's bugging, but yeah, I, 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 more or less, I'm gonna leave her. But I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna enjoy the perks while I'm there. But if I don't get invited, they got that hour. Still got, you still got it. Go. Matter of fact, y'all, they gotta stop now. They, like, they gotta stop immediately, and they have an hour to unpack, to, to pack to everything, pack and get out. pack everything, and be far away from me. Thanks. Because then my hand turns. No, I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. <laughs> Man said, man said his hands are bisexual. Jeez. <laughs> they not. Realistically, I'm just going to leave. After. I buy my perks out. <laughs> and, with, <laughs> and with that being said, we're going to jump into the next topic. Finish no, my podcast. Ex Paul A podcast. Club. Every motherfucking oh, thing you want to fucking call it. <laughs> All right. So can a person only cheat once? Or once a cheater, always a cheater? So will you give him a second chance? Or no, no, like no. y'all always cheating. Fuck you. <laughs> once, once you cheat, once you cheat, you're always gonna cheat. Oh, but you're, you're, you are a dub. Don't talk to me. You're a dub. Fuck you. Why you say that? Fuck, fuck, fuck you cheating with. Fuck the person that you cheated with. I ain't got no beef with him, but fuck him too. Him or her. Him or her. Yeah. Him or her. But fuck you too. You I mean, it's you. never like it's beef with the nigga who nah, fucks nah, 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 your bitch. I, I, but I, he I, has a time I period. Give you, props. you got two months for me not to see you. Like, at least like three months. I don't know. Like, I'm not gonna just act like you fuck my bitch. No. I'm like that shit just cool. Like two months ish, I I might slap you though, but I don't know. If you if you I if if you if you I don't got an op, but if you I then it's an extra fuck. I fuck my bitch, bro. Realistically, if I fuck my bitch, I'm gonna give him the W out of respect. But you're gonna look for vengeance. But like I'm gonna find my vengeance somehow. I don't know. I'm popping tires every time. Every time you get a new one, I'm popping up something. Like you can't just be, you can't just walk away with that. I, I don't know. I'm petty as fuck. Just That's like not King, acceptable. Just, just like King trying to try to put your chair on, up to the blocks. 
Yeah. I no, don't, I don't mention that, bro, because every time Hakeem mentions some shit about my car, it goes something something really <laughs> happens. To me. So, nah, bro, that really was not my fault. fault. It was your fault. Nah. But back to the whole like like if once a cheater, always a cheater. Like I don't know if if my girl cheat on me, like I'm gonna just think I'm gonna I'm gonna backtrack. Like all right, what did I do? Like was I lacking real quick? Like I'm gonna I'm gonna think for a second. Like all right, was I lacking? If I wasn't lacking and, and sh- like I'm just gonna all right, leave. Bye. Like. I don't know. Hey, I feel like she got her two month. He, she got her. No, he got his two month period. Keep your distance. I'm just gonna do my thing. Wow. I'm naturally busy anyway, so like I'm just gonna handle my business. Yeah. But, I, t- but you're always a cheater, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But nah, you cheat, you cheat. But are you cheat? I'm, you don't I'm, think I'm, so? I'm, if you stay with her, oh, if you stay with her, <laughs> then like I, 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 I don't know. I, 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 I know someone. I know someone who's right. gonna stay. Right. Explain <laughs> that, because you're Mr. Bro. I'm staying. Nah, that's. I said, yeah. Listen, I only said I will stay if I was married, bro. No. What's the difference? Well, hell no, there's a big hell difference. Hell no, hell no, hell no. 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 We're married, like I feel like a marriage is different than a relationship. Like it's more commitment. And shit. A marriage is business. <laughs> if it's a commitment, you should have never cheated. You're, if you're really that committed with someone, you put the ring on them, nah, that's fine and they cheat me. on you, bro. They didn't, they were never committed to you. They don't give a fuck. No, about we have that. kids. That's even worse. House, and you cheat on me, like mm-hmm. I'm, I'm giving it all up, bro. But call it weak. I'm giving it all up. Then child support. Yeah, child support. That's that's somebody I should be with, bro. I'm gonna take care of my kids, but you I'm gonna take care of my child. That's, 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 that's a given. <laughs> it's just all about how you normalize the situation afterwards. Like a lot of parents, you know, mm-hmm. they have terrible relationships. The kids, you know, kids go through some crazy shit. I'm not gonna be like that. Me and mom gonna be cool. No, 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 not yet for fact. We gonna be cool. I, I mean, it's gonna be fuck you, bro, but like, I'm not, I'm not gonna like. I'm, I'm not, not gonna put, I'm not gonna put them through that. Like, no, if there's no, no kids no there, bitch. nah, fuck you. Like, nah, you nah, know nah. I mean, like, we have, we have a wedding going, a marriage going on before saying. kids, like, and you cheat on me, like, nah. Uh, so I don't owe you nothing. Like We're soon. getting a divorce. Ah. I'm never looking your way ever again for the rest of my life. My. All right, hold on. So let's... you think she would cheat again? Yes. yes. Yeah. Why? She cheated the first because time. Because if it's not, okay, if it's not in you, it's not in you. He said, he said he, you can build trust again. No. No, you can't. We said, we said, bro, imagine her cheating and then saying, yo, we going out for girls night. Like, in his mind, that shit about to be <laughs> crazy. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Duh. Ah, uh, nah, you right though. You got a point. Like, if I right, so it's <coughs> like I said, bro. It's all about what you do with the situation. Like, if she cheat on you and you stay with her, yeah, y'all could y'all could discuss some type of boundaries, but like, no matter what happens, that's on you. Like, mm-hmm. you gotta just be able to take that. You can't just not let her go to girls' night. Like. I feel like once that's you, lame. That's once lame. You, once you make that decision to like, <laughs> then she go to you, nigga. Like, <laughs> she no gonna cheat on after, after She gonna bring him yeah. in the crib. When she get that chance, it's over. Nah, yeah. You know, I mean, at the end of the day, who knows? It's all about. Uh, are you are you with somebody who, who respects himself? I mean, if they that's did true. that, I don't think they respect themselves. But also too, like some niggas be lacking. Like I know niggas personally who got who who they bitch cheated on them. You know. And it's like that nigga didn't even realize, like, yo, bro, you don't do shit for her. You lacking. Like you you just lacking, bro. You wasn't doing what you were supposed to do. It's not like maybe if she cheat on him, she he'll get his bread up. Exact some I feel like sometimes a nigga gotta get cheated on. I stepped my shit up when I got cheated on. I was like twenty years old. It's never happening again. I mean, whether it happens again or not, I know I'm gonna feel better about myself no matter what. You know what I'm trying to say? I I know the situation. So she cheated and you see? Or you left? I didn't. Well, I, 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 boom, 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 boom. I didn't know at first. It was always assumptions. Afterwards, like a year or a year and a half, maybe two later, Mm -hmm. stories started to hit the streets. And I was like, I, well, like in the moment, I thought I was getting cheated on. I treated it like, I thought I was getting cheated on. But I, when you don't, when you're not 100% yeah, sure, yeah, yeah, you know, you don't want to be like, oh, man, I don't want to walk away from this. I could be wrong. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It was one of those. But I, yeah, ca- yeah. I came to find out, and I was like, oh, 
So you found out after y'all broke up. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so if you, that's if you, if he cheats on you, I'm um, just, just fucking best friend. Wow. Do you guys think that after a relationship, if your significant other ends up with somebody else immediately, they were always fucking with that person? Yes. yes. I don't yes. think so. No. Yes. They might no, not I have. Don't think so. They might not have been always fucking so. with that nah, person, they, but the, they was next in line. That person was always there. But, that person. But, but, no. I don't no, think so. No. Yeah. A female when she starts talking to a guy, she, that means she's emotionally invested in to them. It was just your turn. And, 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 I, and I actually cheat on you, it's, nah, it's the next one. I, so. I don't think so. What? Because let's say she break up with you today. She could meet him at the bar the next week. She didn't know him, but she just started to she, like him. And what that means was, she been done with you. You saw that niggas, like that niggas, you saw that niggas be brokey tweet today? <laughs> that bitch said, I hate when niggas think we on bad terms. Nah, motherfucker, we are done. Because that niggas don't be understanding that sometimes. No, that's like, true, though. The situation's packed up. You just the trying to like, like, you just trying to play defense now. Emotionally, you cock blocking. Female, 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 they be begging. Who manipulates more, men, men or women? Women. Women? <laughs> <laughs> they probably want to go see the lady. <laughs> nah, niggas never. Like niggas never really go see the lady. Only when they about to get left, they say they're gonna go see the lady. But they never really go. They just keep saying they're gonna go, and then things get back on good terms. They feel like they don't gotta go no more. I know a lot of niggas that said they was gonna go see a lady. <laughs> and niggas, you know, niggas pull that one emergency card when they about to get left. The, the emergency card is uh, uh, that the nigga who act like he about to go jump off a bridge. That's bad toxic. Nah. But it goes both ways. <laughs> Granted. Shari's going to pull, gonna pull, gonna pull the, I'm pregnant. Uh-huh. You ever had that? No. Because nah. I have. That was the worst experience of my life. Uh, I got a question. What's the guy's... No, 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 no. We're gonna, we're gonna nah, I ain't going to depth of that. that. But it was it was a terrible experience. Terrible. Terrible. Nah, nah but what's the guy version of that? Of a Ga- girl trapping. Got her the pregnant. guy version is I'm gonna kill myself. Yeah, <laughs> basically, yeah. So I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> How does that or I actually get you pregnant? Nah, I mean, cause you can't trap a girl. She can always, you know, she can always go handle her situation with that. That's what. But I feel like the male version of trapping a female like successfully. I feel like it's when you got mad money and like like I don't know like she lives off you. Like the, that's yeah, the bad. Exactly. That's the, oh, that's really the only way you're gonna trap her is like where's she gonna go? Like you you got she bag. Need you. She, her lifestyle is based off what you putting on the table. So it's either you just gonna cut her cold turkey and she not gonna have that no more, or because you never you can't really trap no woman, bro. Like yeah. they got options, bro. It's just sad. We got no man. We doing bad. It's, it's, we live in a cold world. <laughs> We're doing bad, but we have no options. It's very hard out here in these streets. Uh, a female can pick up her phone and get and get her situation. Like Easy. Then and there. Just like that. You got niggas like Hakeem who who would just, you know. <laughs> if a girl hit you right now, like you trying to fuck, you sliding? No, bro, that's a bobo beater. Whoa. You slide like a random, like, like, say some random, like a girl, you, you just, you follow her, everything's cool, and she just hits you like, yo, you, you trying to fuck me? You gonna fuck her? It depends on the show. I'm dude. not. No, no, it depends nah, on the show. That's, 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 that's a setup. It depends that's on the show, and it's not about to be on her terms. It's gonna be on my terms. Yeah, we can fuck, but not today. I'm busy right nigga, now. Nigga, that's nigga, about to be assed out. <laughs> nah, I'm busy right now. I always say I'm busy right now. I always say I'm busy right now. Yeah, always. Uh, what if it was like something you was like, uh, I really want this stuff. I'm busy right now. What you busy? Nigga, I'm nope. I'm busy right now. Go ahead with that. Well, all right, so, all right, so how long does she have to wait? It's not going to be on her terms. She wanted it, if she wanted it that bad for that night, she could wait one night. So I could set something up. You so you'll fuck her the next night? The next night. I'm going to make her take me out. <laughs> Word to me, you wanna, you're not about to just, nah, take me out, pay for the date, pick me up. I'm riding passenger. Why did you say I'm riding passenger. Uh, 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 whatever it is, I don't know. I like that shit. Like, 
I wouldn't mind that anyway. Whether like whether you didn't DM me like that, I right, cool. yeah. I have no problem with that. Shorty paying for everything. Now that's cool. For the night. For, Not yeah. my lifestyle. For the yeah, night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. No, that's I, yeah. I agree with that. I could agree with that, but like, it also depends on the show. I said, it also depends on the show. So, so would you mind living off a of shorty like 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 shorty breadwinner? Yeah. I'm still gonna make my bread. Like I'm still, yeah, I'm still gonna make my money. But like, if my if I ended up like dating some, I don't know, fucking president of some company, I don't know, the lashes took off. <laughs> so, <laughs> something took, took off. off. I got, yo, the shit. Lashes. I got no problem. Lashes. 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 I had no problem. Like realistically, like I'm, a, I'm gonna be getting my money. So like, if I'm getting when I'm getting mines, or whatever, I'll pay the bills. She'll pay for whatever. Like, you know, I'm still gonna pay the bills though. Like, I'm still living my own space regardless. Mm-hmm. Like, that's how I'm gonna feel secure and healthy in myself. Like, I, I'm paying my bills. Can't nobody tell me what to do. No, no yeah. matter what. You know, she could pay for whatever, food, vacations, the fly shit, do all that shit. But like I'm paying my bills, like. So you know you good without her regardless. If yeah. she cheats on me with another dude who got money or whatever, she, she can't good. keep me out of my house. <laughs> I still got my house. Fuck that. They be trying they be trying to be kicking niggas out their own crib. You letting a girl you you letting a girl kick nah. you out your own crib. I feel nah. like you letting that happen. Nah. You say you staying with her. <laughs> if I'm paying the bills, she's not kicking me out the crib. Ah, right, if my kids is in there, I leave. Cause if, if that's yeah, the only, yeah, if, 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 like, if that's the only kids, option, yeah. like that's like literally kids, my yeah. only yeah. option. But you know how hard it is taking your kids with you in the divorce, bro. Nah, you're not. Yes, it's, yeah, it's, nah, it's they, not. They, possible. If you don't have a valid woman, reason, yeah. she, they automatically win. Nah, if she, they do. The only way for you to get your kids, she has to be a terrible mom. The kids have to say it. And you have to prove that she does not pay the bills in the house or for anything. The only thing she pays for is her for herself. No, that's true. That's what you have to prove in order to get the kids. And there's rarely guys that can actually prove that. I feel like life naturally is just sexist. Like, sexist. Mm-hmm. It is. Why you that? Because let's say you with a girl, somebody go in the crib. She's going to expect you to get up. And do something about it. Mm-hmm. You gotta ask her out. She's gonna expect you to do it. So, with that being said, let's jump into the next topic. And one of the final topics of tonight, right? Because I, I, I like where you're going with this. <laughs> <laughs> because I like where you, it sounds like you're trying to normalize something. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Let me, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> But nah, I just feel like we're expected to do certain things because of our gender. Like certain things gotta, like what? You gotta provide, you gotta protect. Like that's just put on you as a male. Mm-hmm. Ah, that that's acceptable though. Ah. I feel like as a man, we're supposed to provide and protect. That's a given. Yeah. Is it, is if somebody came in my house, I don't want a girl defending my life. If she's not no black belt, the Navy, Army trained, like. Mixed martial arts, specially yeah, trained yeah, exactly. to save my life. I wouldn't. I don't want no. I don't want nobody else to save my life. I want to save my life. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Unless you're not trained to save a life, I want to save my life. Regardless, you feel me? But like, for example, why is it like why are girls having a problem with other women proposing to men? That should Let's be normal. Let's talk about that. We got to normalize this. Nah, I don't see anything wrong with that. Like, what is the actual problem with that? There's no problem with yeah. that. That's just some, super some, normal. Some of them feel like it, 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 it's degrading their, um, um, them, themselves to, um, to propose to a man. Well, a, a, and, and, and it's a man's duty to propose to a woman. I feel like it's the ego. Nah, it's ego. That the shit is super... Ego, it's, like, it's like, you're supposed to do that. I'm not going to get on my knees for you. That shit is super normal to me. I've seen it happen twice, bro. 2014. In person? Yes. 2014, 2015. How was, how did the audience react? We were all confused. <laughs> nah, like, it, the, the very first time I was around, like, I was, everybody at my table, it was like the first time we all seen it. So yeah. it was like, yeah. I was like, oh. And I'm looking around, everybody's like, oh where my is, gosh, oh my how gosh. How do you feel about where it is, in that where, moment? Where, yeah. I was like, damn, I don't want that. Like, if someone loves me that much and they're ready before me, I'll, that'll make me prove myself that I'm ready so also. In that second, you just normalized it in your head. Like, did yeah. They, they I want yes? this. Yes. It's cause I feel like, and the man cried. He cried. Like other women? He cried. Like women wait, wait. Like proposing? He cried. 
He cried? That dude cried. Both of them. Both of them. Both of them. Both of them. That nigga should have came here. Bro, no. they cried. That's his stink stink. Eyes bowling red. That's, stink. That's, stink. That's stinky, That's butt. That's his foul breeze. <laughs> no, That's listen. foul breeze. That's his cinnamon apple. <laughs> That's his cinnamon apple. He cried. Yeah, oh, no. Look, no. Look, no. when I say it should be normalized, I still want to propose to my wife. Mm. But, like, I just don't want anybody to see a problem with somebody. Like, I don't know. What if my man's wife proposed to him? And now he get bashed on Twitter. <laughs> That nigga went off on him on Twitter. Like, yo, you a bitch. Yeah. Nigga, your girlfriend, ah. Like, other girls is violating his woman. Like, don't nobody want to see some shit like that, bro. Like, that's, this, this, mm-hmm. that come, that brings, people don't even understand, like, that brings not their so much more. Like, that makes situations between men and women so much worse. It's not yeah. their relationship. You know what I'm saying? Because if that's not acceptable, what else isn't acceptable? Because that's, that's, it is like, that's the bare minimum. I proposed. All right, you love me you that love much? Me, yeah, yeah. Bro. I got you to love me that much? Isn't that my job? Bro, it's your, it's your <laughs> it's Isn't that my job? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm not here to get you to love me as much as you possibly can, and get you to. Like, I can't get you to love yourself. That's you know. But like, you got a job. Like, job. Like, I got. I did. I did my job successfully to the point where you like. You know, I'm locking this nigga in. And now that's a problem. Now that's <laughs> that's not, not that's not a problem. I'm, I mean, like, yeah. I'm not gonna say I'm gonna be upset, but like, I want to propose to my wife. Nah. I feel the same way. Because you know what I'll do? The next time we go, I'll propose to you too. So you just go do it right back? Yeah, do it right back. He said we're even. Hey. Hey. Oh, we playing over here, man. We playing hey. on the shit. Oh. We, we don't do that here at the spot. We're not at the spot. I'm the parlay, maybe. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, don't do that. Don't do that. Nah, nah. nah see, gay. y'all making it seem like the hashtag I'm not crazy. Gay. Nah, he says some crazy shit. Nah, 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 nah. We're like. Is, is, is a relationship dead if, if is a relationship dead if they say no? Yes. If they oh okay, you so see that shit? Homeboy proposed to Shorty and she said no and he bought her a car. Oh, I see. Oh, I saw that. that. Bro, that and she said he bought her a car. That, 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 that. A car it was crazy. But for in two weeks. Two, two weeks, weeks later, later he, he spent his next check. She's cheating on him. He spent his next check. What do you mean? She cheating on him. She cheating on him? Yes, bro. She has to. She Bro, she didn't nah, say thank you. She didn't hug him. She didn't kiss him. Nothing. She bro. said keys. She said what the keys? She said, "Is that, that for me? Like, can I see the papers?" He said, what? "Yeah, yeah." Thank you. Nah, that's beta. I that's know. a choose me situation. Right? That is a choose me situation. I don't know. Is the relationship done? It's yes. Over. Yes. What if what if homeboy jumped the gun? No, though? no, no, nah, no, it's no, over, bro. Niggas be it's, proposing. It's over. If, I don't know, like no. If you didn't have a nigga the conversation, will know. you should have had a conversation. Yeah, yeah, you gotta have a conversation. Head. You gotta have the conversation. A nigga will know he'll want to marry you on day three. Yeah. G shit. A nigga will know he'll want to marry nah. you on day three. Nah, that's lust. No, yeah. that's lust. But no. I, I don't know any girl I want to marry. No. Day that's, three. You haven't met that girl yet. That's Bro, why. how do you know? Because you like, you'll know. Day three. Nah, day nah, three is crazy. You'll know. Nah, nah, nah. Day three. It gotta be the craziest day three ever. I'm talking day like three. if I had a million dollars on the third day, I got robbed, I got no more money, and she's still with me three years later and watched me get that money back. Ah, uh, you know what? I knew I was right about you. <laughs> I knew I was right about you. But like, nah, yeah, it has to be the most craziest day three ever, bro. Because there's you, no nah, way. I feel like for I'm, talk, I'm, time. I'm not talking about day three of talking. I'm talking about day three of you guys being serious. You don't know. Nah, nah, nah. nah. That's yes. early, bro. Nah, no. Nah, if you know nah, that you that's who you want to be with for the rest of your life, you'll know. I'm telling you. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. Hell no. Yes. Nah, bro. Nigga, what? Yes. No. Nigga, day Yo, three, bro. Yes. That means I met her in front of my mom, in front of my friends, no. when I was in broke. Three days. Uh, in three days, bro. Uh, no. Uh, what else? Who else matters? No. That means I spent three days with her while I was mad busy and she was not annoying. Uh, she I don't, it, craziest three days ever, bro. No funny shit. I got jumped and and she not judging me <laughs> on the third day. I don't know, bro. Three days? Yeah. Nah, that's a, that, that bro, three days know. has to be a crazy nah, three days, three days, three days bro. bro There's know, no way I, 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 I was just linking with you for three days, having a conversation, smashing your fucking guts in, and I think I'm about to marry you. Nah. I would have thought I was going to marry know. every girl I ever been with. Nah, that's crazy. <laughs> nah, I'm telling you, you'll know. Nah, three days got it. Explain you'll know. You'll know. You'll know. You'll know. No, 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 explain. Nah, explain. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, what? Bro, you'll what? Know. what does this three days look like to you? 
Bro, I'm just saying, like, <laughs> three days on a vacation? <laughs> right. Bro, like, we, yo, we, no. We went on a beach in Hawaii, y'all, some shit? Bro, y'all just know. That's that it. means in three days I was dating you. I had one the day. best. I had the best. Everything three days of my was life lit. With you. The second day we broke up, and we got back <laughs> on the third day. But on that third day I got robbed, oh. and you met me in front of my mom. And all that. All the drastic know. shit had to happen. All the drastic shit happened in, in three days for me to know I could fuck with you. Or like I don't know if I was like dead homeless and you were sleeping with me on the couch for three days. I, f- I don't know. There's a couch somewhere under the bridge. I don't. F- I don't fucking know. <laughs> you feel me? And, and you was with me then for three days. Alright, no, 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 maybe, no. maybe. You know, home- homeless people. Maybe like even like old people. Old people fell in love quick. Oh, yeah. Nice little coffee. And that's it. It's on. <laughs> I'm telling you, yo, no. Yeah, I mean, uh, well, when even I when you're young, right? Everybody made that mistake when you're young. You know what I mean? Y'all read the newspaper together, type shit. Right. Y'all read the same section in the paper. You had a conversation about it. Got some coffee. Now you're married and wow. you die like three, four years later. You know, like, look at Uzi and JT. Huh? That one day that they spent together, bro. Tell you what to talk about. <laughs> he gave her, he gave her like what, thirty grand or something like that. Took her shopping. Is that sucker shit? And then took her to Taco Bell right after. Is that sucker shit? Does the money play? Or are you tr- you ain't tricking if you got it. You believe I mean, in that? You ain't tricking like if you got it. You got it. He got it. He got like that. Like, but she she also said that she wanted to fuck with him. I mean, look, if 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 somebody feel like they want to fuck with you, also to Uzi's a Leo. Like that nigga, you know, he a show out, so he just gonna show out realistically. Yeah. That's just that, that don't even got it. He gonna do that regardless. You don't know. You don't even know. He could have been doing that for any bitch. Nah, that's right. He's still beating on his ex. That was od. <laughs> That was only, I don't know. I don't really know how JT stayed with somebody who beat on the ex. Does that mean he likes her? Is that cheating? If you're, <laughs> if you're in a relationship and you beat your ex, uh, is that cheating? Hey. <laughs> is that cheating? You spend the time with him. But is that cheating, though? <laughs> is that cheating? Because if you beat on your ex and you touch because, him. like, say, <laughs> like say, I, say I'm, I'm on a on date. Her. Say I'm on a date. And... Shorty's ex sees us on a date and he comes and just start whooping her ass. And he whoops her ass. <laughs> but he got a girl. They still fucking. He, he got he got plans for her. Did he cheat on his girl with my girl? Probably. Nah. That sound like you getting cheated on. <laughs> that I don't know sound like I'm getting cheated on. That nah, sounds nah, like somebody else getting cheated on. The nah, yeah, situation. Right. The situation. Yeah. Like it's JT getting cheated on. Nah, that's it. Cause he shouldn't care. Right? I'm wrong. You shouldn't care. If you, if you, if you wish somebody, you shouldn't care. That don't mean oh, nothing. Nah, that's right. You gotta forget everybody else. That's cheating, Damn, gang. It's empty. If my ex go beat on her nigga, her ex nigga, because he's with somebody else, you can have that nigga. You shouldn't even be around your ex. At all. Can Especially if you got a nigga. You could be around. Can you, can you, can you think be you could be around? Can you be friends with your ex? I mean, it's Can not you like, be friends with your ex? Yeah. yeah. No, 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 no. Are no, you no. cool with that? Your girl being friends with her ex? Yeah, but like now there's there's some limitations to that. Like how cool are y'all? Y'all on FaceTime every night? That's just like Do y'all right. link? What? Like, uh, fuck nah, y'all gonna say Y'all cool, yo, yo, what's up? Yo! No, y'all could just check in. I say what's up too, like yo, what up, bro? Why y'all linking? Nah, y'all could just check in on the phone, that's it. Like, oh hey, every once in a while, that's it. Nah. That's it. Wait, whoa, nah, if you ever. Matt, that guy can't be friends. Nah, nah, nah. nah. Yeah, that's that's shit. Shit. Hey, my ass is going to be That's basically what you were saying. Y'all saw each other. You heard how crazy that sounded, right? If y'all that's basically other, what you was trying to say. Nah, if y'all saw each other in the mall. Like, yo, what's good? Like, yo. That's it. What up? Y'all saw each other at a party? Yo. Like, like, like. You know how, like, some girl, like, like, boom. You know how, like, you'll be somewhere, you'll be like a friend, and then she'll be like, oh, I can't be here. Such and such is here. My ex is here. Yeah. yeah. That shouldn't bother you. That's how I need my shorty to be. Yeah, you can be in the same room. Everything is cordial. Everything is cool. All right, cool. But, like, if she, like, if I feel uncomfortable, I feel uncomfortable regardless. Yeah. yeah. You feel me? If y'all don't face something every night, that's, I don't know what I mean. Like, that's I'm going to face something with my ex every night. Oh, I know why. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. If I'm going to face something with my ex every night. Oh, I thought you oh, said no. you I thought you said you were. were. No! That's what I thought you said. Nah, no! Yeah, that's, what, that's what we thought you said. No, we don't double back. Nah. You don't spin the block? No spinning blocks. <laughs> no spinning blocks.
No spinning blocks. I feel like that's toxic. Though. Spinning blocks? Yeah. What's the, all right, all right, all right, before we get out of here, right? <laughs> what's the, what's the, I'm trying to show you how to word it, like, what's the longest somebody could take before they spin the block? I said like a year. Yeah, yeah, not, not, not yet. To be realistic, not to be like an <laughs> asshole. To be right. realistic, like a year. Bro. It depends on how heavy you was fucking with the person. Bro, bro, even if you're not fucking with a person heavy like that, niggas, niggas, niggas still spin the box. I say yeah. like six months to a year. Yeah, it, it also, it, it, does, but it also depends how heavy you was fucking with the person. If they got that wet and gushy, niggas gonna spin the block. Or what? Yeah, if she got the she gushy. She just to fuck them, not to stay. Not to stay, it don't matter. I mean, like, it doesn't matter. it's all about what you was doing anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm spinning. But it's like, you know, it depends on how heavy you was fucking with the person. There's always a limitation. So if you was rocking with it for like three months, you got like, you got like four months to spend the Four month. months? You got like four <laughs> months. If it's six months and less, you got max five months to spend the block after you're done. Five months? Five months. That's it. Five months. Months. How you spending the block five months and you was only together for three months? I said anywhere up to six months. Is it anything, anything up to six months? Yeah. Oh, okay. The okay, max okay. you can get is five months. Out of schemes. Schemes. <laughs> or is this way? This this is where it should be. I've I've been nah. put onto game by certain females. This is what they told me themselves. Okay. Alright. So what if you rock with it for like a year? They give you almost another year. A year, maybe more. I feel like if I'm fucking with you for a year, and we didn't work out, yeah. I'm not about to wait another year to waste another year. Like nah, 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 nah. nah. Like, like if I didn't get the time to like fill it out, I feel like if it was like three months, then I'll be like, okay, maybe a year later we could like try this out again. But if I already wasted a whole year. I, nah, I, I, I boom. I boom. Nah, it, it right. also depends nah, on how, how nah, you nah, like boom. ended. If you ended on some serious yeah, true, shit, true, true. then you definitely not spending the block for nothing. Boom. But fucking um, say say you had to try your like how like how, like I don't know high, high school middle school type shit, and and, and then, then, then 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 you see her now, and, and you spend the block, and, and you spend the block now. If I was rocking with it in high school, I mean that only counts. So I'm like, it's like a. Uh, I don't already reset. It already reset. Yeah. Like once you once you get that diploma, it reset, bro. Realistically, like it reset. reset. So you get out of high school, something, something then you get a real relationship. If it was ever, if if you was fortunate enough, if if you were fortunate enough to get a real relationship, then you get a real one. Then you realize the shit you was in was whack, and then like you know, it was childish as hell. No, yeah. Yeah, you know, you were taking the bus to their spot, like, oh, you like the school bus. <laughs> to their, I don't know. That's just whack. When we get yeah, an actual chance, like, y'all yeah. staying at the school together. Yeah, that's just like reset. So, like, you could definitely double back after high, high school. school. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yo, so, yo, sometimes you just gotta, like, taste it all. You, 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 got, you, got, you gotta find your flavor. Right? That yeah. was actually my last situation. <laughs> now that I really think about it. Like a high, high school fling? It was a high school fling and then a double back. Okay. But, but, I didn't double back. But, but, but weren't you saying that? that weren't you saying that you don't, you don't double back? I did not double did back. It. That's what he's trying to say. Uh, he's, so he's if she double back, you be with it? Yeah, it depends. Like you said, it really all depends on how it ended last time. Nah, yeah, it's facts. Yeah. If it ended up with something that you could fix, then, you know. So if she cheated on you. There's no fixing that. In yeah. high school. Though, nope. Nah. Where nope. it resets. <laughs> no. <laughs> nah. There's no doubling back. There's no double back if you cheat. You don't think she got the demons out? Nah. No. Nah, hell no. Nah. You don't think that you don't think it's possible for somebody to get no. their demons out? No. But, but, but she's still fighting them. How, I, how long has it been after you think high all, You think Offset's still cheating? Nah. <laughs> ain't no way he's still you cheating. You don't think you don't think niggas get their demons out? Offset's still cheating. Nah, he's not still cheating, bro. All right. He's still cheating, he's still bro. Cheating. He's still cheating, bro. He's still cheating, bro. He's still cheating, bro. Yeah, bro, they about to go on tour. They, on tour, cheating, bro. crazy. Tour, tour, bro. He's still cheating, bro. They were in a pandemic. He couldn't cheat. They about to nah, go on tour, bro. He's he cheating. Cheat. Bro, he's a millionaire. Bro, bro, you better bro. go on tour. You, you have too much faith in Offset. Bro. Who's she going to leave the kids with? I know you're rich, bro. When you're rich, She's pregnant again. Hold on. She's pregnant again. Listen, when you're rich when you're rich like that, when you're out and about, everything else is a slice of cake. You just gotta remember you got a bakery at home. Nah, don't take that advice, y'all. That is some fucked up shit. Do not. <laughs> <laughs> like when you're famous, up. it's easier to that get caught up, bro. 
Yeah. It's easy to get caught cheating? Yeah, you're under the light. Exactly. NDA, what are you talking about? Bro, you know, bitch. NDA, nah, bro. You put you tax that NDA. You speak on this, you gonna owe me a, you gonna owe me bands. And these bitches be broke. Facts. Yeah, see true. That's how they get away with it, bro. Realistically, bro. Future, these they put these they put the girls on NDAs, bro. Like you're not gonna say a word about this. It's OD, but then you have girls like um, what's that girl's name? The infamous um, the porn you know who I'm talking about? She be on Adam Twenty Two shit. The porn star. She nah, don't nah. care, bro. She be ripping all NDAs in half, bro. She nah, go on his nah. shit and she say everything. The I one that's, her name. that 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 brought her friend. She up. told she lied to on Cardi B. She said that what's her face? That, Offset got her offset, pregnant. And then she apologized. Porn star? Oh no. Nah. She's not a porn star. She's not a porn star. Oh, she's not. She's just a. Yeah, that, she's that, literally an infamous thot. But well, she, she's, she's the one that fucked the son. Her friend was oh, crazy. She, she, yeah. she, 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 was it the son? Yeah, yeah, I think like it that. was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold them, hold them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. oh, her friends gave head. Yeah, yeah. Not D-Book. Suck the whole team off. Not not D-Book. Oh, she had throw me. I think D-Book had to be there, bro. He had. Well, they wouldn't have the time. DeAndre Ayton was in there definitely, the way he's throwing these alleys. For sure. That team got. Hundred percent, yeah. But we gonna we gonna end it off at that, y'all. So, um, yeah, we gonna we gonna end this off the way we started it, nice and sweet. Appreciate y'all for tuning in today. This is the Parlay X Spot Podcast. It's your boy King with the A guy with the Parlay, the Parlay, and um, yeah, we out of here. Yes, sir.